guys it's your girl Patrika and welcome back to my channel so your girl is back today with another luxury unboxing and today's unboxing is from Louis Vuitton so your girl recently I think I got this like maybe a week and a half ago but I definitely wanted to do an unboxing just because I know that you guys love my unboxing so I'm like you know what let me wait to film this guy to film this video and just let you guys know my first impressions and whether or not it is worth the coins so i love watching videos like this so i also love to film videos like this but yeah we are back and so let's see what i got so this person i got was for this fall winter season i really needed a like everyday type of bag that i can wear this fall slash winter because i have like black and other colors but i don't i didn't really have like an everyday type of bag so i did purchase this everyday bag and as you guys can see from the title this is the speedy 30 bag a classic you know and that's something else that i know about my, that i know about myself is that i love to um I love to get classics because they're always going to be in in style. And one thing when you have a classic, you can always resell it because they're always going to be in demand versus getting like seasonal items, if you guys know what I mean. So that's just something super important to take note of. Always get classics. And so, first of all, we're going to talk about the packaging. I love the packaging. It just comes in like this square brown box and it has a cute little ribbon on it and by the way one thing that i always make sure i keep on to is the receipt because if you ever want to re resell your bag or anything it is always important to hold on to this so that people can just see that you do have the receipt i don't know why even if the time expired for it to be returned people just love receipts so i always make sure that i hold on to my receipt and i am also going to tell you guys the pricing and everything but let's unbox this and so it does come with like this blue ribbon on the box and i really love louis vuitton packaging the color and the aesthetic i just really like it so this is what it looks like super cute and so now we are going to unveil it just like this you guys i've been wearing this bag for a little minute but i'm gonna tell you guys how hard it was to actually get my hands on. and so this is it and so this is actually my first bag from Louis Vuitton, so I'm super excited. But this is what it looks like. So when the bag do come, it does come inside of a dust bag already. And I always love to keep my luxury items in a dust bag just to protect it. You know, keep it from wear and tear and to store it. So this is a dust bag and it does says Louis Vuitton on it super cute and super simple and so now we are going to take this off oh my gosh i'm so excited i'm so excited by the way i probably am going to keep this box just because i love it and it will definitely match my house aesthetic and so i'm definitely going to keep this box so let's put this baby up okay guys so this is it inside of its dust bag oh my gosh and so voila this is the bag <laughs> this is the speedy 30 okay let me just make sure that my locking key is in here okay good so i do have my locking key which was super important to me i just had to make sure that it was in here but you guys this is the speedy 30 bag oh my gosh i wanted this bag for a minute for a hot minute but i'm just gonna tell you guys this bag was super hard to find because i went inside the louis vuitton store and the one of the workers there to, like they have um the internet where they can or like a device that they can use to see whichever item you want like how many of it how many items is in the country what stores and everything she told me that there was only like two stores in the entire united states that had this bag but there was only like two left in stock like this bag was super hard to find when i tell you she told me that inside the louis vuitton store i just so happened to be at the mall and so i ended up checking Saks because so they have a louis vuitton store inside of Saks. so i just checked just to say you know what let me just double check and see if they have the bag in there and you guys they had the bag in there so that's just something that definitely 
So guys, I just want to say that as of right now, I just checked the Louis Vuitton website and I have been checking for a while and this bag is still sold out online. So you can't even find this bag when you search online. So it really is very hard to find your, get your hands on this bag because it's sold out online right now. And it's been this way for a long time because I used to just always go on the website and look to see if I could order the bag online and it's always sold out. So yeah, this um, worker was definitely right keep in mind if you go to a freestanding Louis Vuitton store and don't have an item always try to go to like Saks Fifth Avenue and try to look inside um like a Louis Vuitton store or Dior store whatever type of store inside of Saks because I'm guessing their inventory is different because when I went inside of the Louis Vuitton store inside of Saks I saw the bag and I gagged so you guys this is it oh my gosh First of all, um, one thing that I do love is that it has space in here. So that's another thing that I do want to say. When I did go to the freestanding um, Louis Vuitton store, they didn't have the Speedy 30 in stock. And by the way, I went to Boca Raton Mall. So this is everything happened at the Boca Raton Mall, which is located in Florida. But when I went to the Louis Vuitton store, they didn't have the Speedy 30 in stock. They had a Speedy 25. But for me, the Speedy 25 was a little bit too small just because I know I know that I wanted an everyday type of bag. And so I know that I was going to have to like hold some things in here, like my phone, my purse, my wallet, any of like my daytime, my hairbrush maybe. Like, you know, just, just everyday little essential items so i already knew of the top like the speedy 25 is too small so i'm happy that i did not settle because i ended up finding the perfect size so first things first i do want to say that it has space like it can hold your everyday items and i act absolutely love this so the inside is like a red color and there is a zip in there with the louis v um zipper and so it has like a pocket in here as well that you can like put cash in a small wallet and anything of that sort so i'm loving the space and i also love the colors because most of my um wardrobe for this fall season i have like a lot of you guys see how i'm wearing brown right now i have like a lot of browns and nudes and so that's why i needed a bag that i can really wear to match my outfits just because I do have a black like taupe that I wear every day now, but it doesn't really go with a lot of my clothes. So like my wardrobe is more on, like the nudish. I have a lot of like um you guys know like warm tone clothes. So this is why I did need a purse of this color, this color aesthetic. So this is definitely gonna be like my everyday essential bag for this fall winter. And then you know once spring come back around, I'll get another one and um i do have a couple purses right now to last me through so i'm excited about that but i love the color because i just been loving brown and so this is everything and so like i said it does come with the lock and key which i'm definitely am going to be using it comes like this small um drawstring bag this is so important for me because i don't know about your girl but you guys know that I am, I do work in the nightlife and everything. So if I ever take my bag to work, which I probably won't, but you know, sometimes after like the first couple months, you don't even care no more. Cause like I said, this is more like an everyday bag. So who knows? It probably will come to work with me, whatever. I'm going to make sure that I do put this lock on it because I don't want nobody going in my stuff. So I love how it does come with the lock and key because your girl is definitely going to be locking this baby up. Okay. And so... This is the lock and it, and oh, this is cute. This is the lock and it, it comes with two sets of keys. So that's also super amazing because um, if I ever like bring this out, I'm just gonna make sure that I keep a set of key at my house. So that you know you don't lose both pair so i really love this and this gold lock is everything so i'm gonna make sure that i put this up and so i'm gonna tell you guys the cost of everything but oh my gosh i'm loving this i'm really loving it and um, i'm definitely going to be wearing it this week <laughs> this is everything this is everything and so let's see so like I said, I did get this from the, the Louis Vuitton inside of Saks in Boca Raton. And so the price for this was $1,370. 
And so with taxes and everything, it came up to $1,465.90. There it is. Saxon Avenue receipt. So you can kind of say it was like, so yes, definitely keep that in mind if you do decide to go with the one that has the. I also would love to add that they do have the speedy that comes with the straps. So there is like um two straps on the side of the bag and that speedy is a couple hundred dollars more. But I did decide to go with the speedy that does not come with the straps. But as I said, there is a lot of girls that I do see wearing the purse with the straps. So that's definitely an option to keep in mind. And when you go to the store, they do ask which one would you like, the one with the strap or the one without the strap the straps but you guys i honestly love it and i honestly wish i would have got this sooner just because i know this is something that i'm going to be wearing for a minute um it's just a great everyday type of bag if i'm traveling i can like put some things in here like it's just super cute and it's super stylish so i just like to invest in classy pieces that i know that i can wear a lot and this is it I do know that the Neville is um, very popular, but because I already have a tote that I wear every day, I'm like, do I want to buy another tote? And I said, you know what? Let me just switch it up. Let me switch it up. And so that's why I decided to go with the Speedy instead. But looking inside, there is a lot of space and I just really love this bag. Like, I really love it. I really love it. <laughs> and this is definitely the perfect fall winter essential item. Now I'm trying to make sure that I answer because um, I'm trying to see, make sure that I don't forget anything, but do I think this bag is worth the money? Yes, it definitely is. If you're looking for like an everyday type of bag, now this is definitely a daytime. I'm gonna wear this out in the daytime or, or whatever like that, but I'm loving it. I am loving it. I think it's super cute and I definitely think it is essential, so. If you're watching this because you're thinking, you're contemplating on buying a Speedy, I really feel like go for it. Go for it. You will love it. And it's a classic. So why not? Anyways, I really want to thank you guys so much for watching this Speedy Louis Vuitton 30 unboxing. If you guys have any questions down below, just let me know. I try to answer all, I try to touch points based on everything that I think that you guys might want to know. But if there's anything else that you guys want to know, then comment down below. And make sure you subscribe to see lots of more unboxings and fashion content and entrepreneur videos and just everything and lifestyle videos. So thank you guys so much for watching. Subscribe and make sure you guys follow me on Instagram at glamdoll underscore Patrika. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.